Hi everyone, Rising Fun Gaming here, and we're back with another weapon overview. This time we're looking at the lance under all the four styles. We all know what the lance is, it's that long thrusting spear that comes with a shield. So we're going to be looking at the guild style first, and we will be getting a new move. The third hit after initiating a combo can be a multi-hit as you see here. But what's really cool, um, you can do this after a counter. So one, two, the third hit's a counter, follow up with one, and then get another one. So you get it on the third and fifth hit, it's really cool. Now this multi-strike will be available for all styles except for striker. And um, what's really cool is you get trip protection for that as well. So height and damage and trip protection. This is the aerial style. You're also getting the multi-hit in the air for this one, which is cool. You can initiate the uh, charge in the air and finish it on the ground, and you can finish up with a sweep if you'd like. The X and A horizontal sweep will only be available for guild and aerial, by the way. All right, now we're looking at Bushido, and you get this guard encounter. And everyone's going to be calling this cross counter because he literally paints a cross in the air for the counter attack. It's really cool. Now we're looking at the striker style, and the first hunter art they're showing us is the shield assault. So basically, you run with your shield out, and um, you're going to be protecting yourself the whole time you're running into the monster, and then you bash into it for impact damage, and then you can follow up with the thrust of your lance. Up next we've got the new one, Guard Rage. And this one's interesting. You get in a defensive stance and the attack that you take will transfer energy to the hunter and he can um, then use that energy for a limited time to get the monster back. Interestingly we saw two different attacks there and the um, energy that went onto the um, actual lance was different colors. Um, the first attack that he took was a single claw swipe from the Hermitor, giving him a red looking lance. But interestingly, when the second attack hit, the double claw swipe, he had an orange color. So it looks like we're going to get different um, amounts of power um, that we can get from the monster's attack. So that's very, very interesting to see. All right, I think that's about all we need to talk about for the lance. Hopefully you enjoy the lance in Monster Hunter Cross. It looks to be a really cool weapon with a lot of new stuff chucked in so I can't wait to use it myself.